first grade, we have moved locations. I am now in my kitchen. We're just going to get a fun tour of my house through this whole remote learning situation. So today what we're going to be doing in our science lesson is our objective is I'm going to say I can compare and contrast Earth and Venus. So we have Earth and we have Venus, which are two of our inner planets. And they are very similar to one another because they're even called sister planets. And so our job today is to compare and contrast those two planets. But the way that we are going to be doing this is by using a graphic organizer called a Venn diagram. Now this is something that we've used before in first grade, but I want to review it to make sure you are clear about how we can help us understand some patterns in our solar system. So when it comes to using a Venn diagram, it's basically two circles that overlap in the middle. And when I say compare, I'm talking about the center section right here. This area is what you will be marking as things that are the same or similar about Earth and Venus. Then on the outside of our circles, this is where you'll be putting things that are unique to that planet. So we're going to do a quick example that is not Earth and Venus, but it's about Miss Arbuckle and our co-teacher Miss Quinn. So we're going to take a look and I want you to think about Miss Arbuckle and Miss Quinn and I want you to think what do we have that's similar that's the same and how are we both different. So take a moment to think about that push pause and then when you're ready you can unpause. All right so let's get started first grade. I know off the bat that one thing that is the same about myself and Miss Quinn is that we are both teachers. That's one thing that we have in common. I also know that we both teach at Mitchell. Something else that we have in common. Something else that we have in common is that we both live in Chicago. We also both wear glasses. So many things in common. But there are still things that are very different about Miss Quinn and myself. So one thing that I could say is that Miss Arbuckle is short and Miss Quinn is tall. I also know that Miss Arbuckle has two cats and Miss Quinn does not have a pet. I also know that Miss Arbuckle has brown hair and Miss Quinn has blonde hair. Okay, we could say Miss Arbuckle likes to ride her bike and Miss Quinn likes to play tennis. So these are just some of the things that we could say that we can compare and contrast between myself and Miss Quinn. And when I use my Venn diagram, it becomes very clear to see the, these sections are what's different about us, and then the center is what is the same. So when we think about Earth and we think about Venus, you are going to do on your Seesaw app a Venn diagram where I'm going to hopefully see two things about Earth, two things about Venus that are unique, and then at least two things that are similar between the two planets. Now, to help you out on your sea salt um, app, I do have a reading passage that compares and contrasts the two planets, and I read it out loud to you. So you can listen to that first and then fill in your Venn diagram. Okay, first grade? So head over to sea salt. Remember, you're comparing and contrasting Venus and Earth using our Venn diagram. All right, first grade, very excited to see these. Take care.